Hey Tinkers, Bunza Duck here. Today we have Tunster181. He's in his STA2. He's on proc in an encounter battle in a pure tier 8 game. So the STA2, uh, you know, it, it's a f it was a fun tank. I didn't do real well in it. Um, uh, and, um, you know, I, I think that the, the 90 millimeter gun is a little lacking in, in punch. Um, but it's it's pretty sprightly, and it, you know it's good for creeping over the hills, and, and it's nice and tall, so it has fairly good view range. Um, but obviously, Tonester knows how to play this thing, or he's played the hell out of it. He's got three marks on it. So um, anyway, Tonester sent this to me. He's been very very busy, and, and just hasn't had a chance to do many videos uh, on his own channel. And uh, so he sent this to me, and I said, sure, I will be happy to help you out anytime I can. So, Tonster, anytime you need a video done, you let me know. Um, anyway, he's uh, spawned in the north, and he's headed over to the hill, it looks like. So, Tonster, take it away. So, like I said, it's a 90mm gun. It's got, what is this, a 240 Alpha with a 212 penetration. If he fires the, the heat, it's a 275, and the HE's got a 320 with a 45. So fairly accurate I mean I yeah, the STA 2 if I'm correct is the premium and the STA 1 is the uh, tank the tech tree if I'm correct and toaster I see that you also do not have any uh, camo on that tank what's up with that what's up with that feels a little naked out here I'm a little embarrassed And Toaster's coming up to the hill. See what he can see. Oh, there we go. We got a Pantera. Pulls back behind the bush. Drops a nice little piece of something, something on him. And you got spotted. Hmm. Apparently, he did not pull back far enough. <laughs> or something. I'm not sure what spotted you. Uh, anyway, the bush did not give you the camo that you expected. Charioteer. Tonster just gives him a little spot. Sets off his sixth sense if he's got it and sends him packing down the hill. Alright, you get the requisite uh, bunch of TDs on the 1 2 line along with the ISM. A couple of heavies in the middle. Favorite Artie in the back. And of course, Tonster. And it looks like two heavies. Three heavies. Oh, what is that? IS seven. What is that? Seven hundred three dash two. Going. Is he doing? I mean, I applaud the the effort of getting up there and trying to force the force their hands. But good God, man, that is not a good situation for you. And you don't have the support. And here comes the uh, GF. You can the guy in the app. That doesn't work. Your IS-3 and your uh, Tiger-2, they're, like, uh, they're falling back. They're not going to do it. They're not following the 703-2 up there. Tone's just trying to give them all the help he can. Apparently your Artie is not awake. I don't know what they're firing at. They must be trying to get the WZ and the Scorpion. 703 has decided, oh, there's an arty shot. Nicely done. 703 has decided he's probably made a very, very bad choice here. Again, if you're going to make that maneuver, it, it can work, but you've got to have the backup to do it. And uh, 703 didn't have it. The IS-3 and the uh, Tiger-2 were not going to do that. <laughs> All right, so Tunster's getting up here trying to do some spotting. See if you can get some spots. Some assistance with these guys. Got a Basante down there. You're a mill and your AMX 65T. Or not doing a lot. There's that Pantera again. Oh, and he gives you a nice side shot, so you give him a little, little something, something there, and then he takes some more damage. Have to reload. Bounces a shot, but he's dead. Okay, boom! Oh, and that's I think the first one you hit. <laughs> and he's like, "I'm paying you back now, buddy." And you bounce two of those shots, nicely done. And now he's on the reload, and you're gonna step in and give him something, something. Back. Oh, but the FB seven two oh seven has something to say about that. Mm. 
Man, there's a critical. Oh, he's tracked. He's, he's hit again. Oh, there you go. Man, the gun reload. I thought that was bad for a little bit faster than this, but geez, six point. It's amazing how much six seconds seems when you're playing a game, right? It's like an eternity. You know, but in real life, it's like boom. Anyway, that's that's my philosophy for the day. Uh, <laughs> toaster's coming back up up the hill. Now you will notice that the game plates are going to be a little funky because uh, Watt replays is down. I'm not sure if I said that already, but uh, it, it, they're doing mainnet, so I had to load the games into my client, use my replay mod to uh, pull up the game plate. So yes, they will look a little funky, and they were pre-recorded. Pre-recorded. <laughs> All right, so Tunster, what do you got going on here, buddy? Getting some spotting damage, not a whole lot of regular damage. Whoa, whoa, getting a little crazy there. But it's one thing about Tonsters play, he's a very patient player at times. I mean, from what I've seen, he's just... He doesn't do anything without seriously considering the ramifications. <laughs> and he seems to know all the spots. Willing to try things, and that's part of it. He knows that fine line between being overly aggressive and being too passive. I've yet to figure that out. had the luxury of platooning with Tonester and it is a fun time. Very informative, great guy to learn from. He's just doing some spotting, but nobody's taking the bait, buddy. Nobody is taking the bait. You guys finally, uh, low, did he back out? He done? Pushes up a little bit further, just a little bit further. I mean, if your sixth sense goes off, you're you're toast. <laughs> I'm trying to sit back so that you guys don't see the you know my bottom of my chin doesn't get cut off by the bottom of the screen. There's a shot into the Basante C45, El Basante. Oh, does he give it? Oh yeah, well that would have been nice. Any feather one in there? No. Nope. How come that? Well, that Pantera's on the other side. Okay, yeah, there we go. All right, well, your 1-2 line is making their move. Timber. Ball's back a little bit here. See if you can get some shots into the Basante. Nope, the low's back. The low's back. His sixth sense just went off, and he's like, okay, who spotted me? Who's spotting me? Already stuns. And you take a shot, and he's down. Nicely done. P44 is now pushing up there. He's going to try and get a shot in here. Oh, there's somebody shot. Assuming, oh, yeah, yeah, it's the Basante. He wants a piece, too. Oh, and he gets a chunk. But that's okay, you got a few hit points to give. Falling behind the Chrysler GF. Your team is pushing down the 1-2 line now. You're starting to encircle them. And snare them into your trap. And Toaster's going to come around in behind. See if he can't get in behind the uh, C-45. Did the Pantera bite it? Yes, he did. Okay. Oh, hey, Mr. Artie. One. He, does he just... Yeah. He's like, just go ahead. Just shoot me. I mean, I've played Artie, too. And it's just like, you know what? At that point, you might as well just accept it. And there's another one. I don't know. That's something to do with the replay where it doesn't... It just doesn't fall the gun all the time. That really pisses me off. Anyway. There's the C-45. And you put him out of your misery. And that is how you STA-2. That's a victory. All right. Well, you got him. Ace tanker, spotter, fighter, duelist, fire for effect, Pascucci's medal, 
69,732 in experience, 1,469,732 in credits. Jesus, 1,438 in experience. You did 2,071 in damage, got 4 kills for base XP of 1,307. You fired 17 shots, of those 13 hit, and of those 10 penetrated. You did 579 from 300 meters out, you blocked 720, and you spotted for, or you got assistance for 3,092. Uh, free to play account, but you still made money and still made some good experience. So, all in all, a really good game there for you, Tonester. So, that's Tonester181 and his STA2 on proc and an encounter battle. If you like the video, hit the like button. Keep those videos coming. I greatly appreciate it. Please remember to hit the subscribe button. This is Bonsai Duck out.